The energy vibration reading for the Pisces Sun, Moon, and Rising, and it's the month of April 2018. I want to say to you guys thank you for being here thank you for being back this is going to be a wonderful month for you Pisces I'm not sure about the rest of the water people because I haven't finished the readings but for the Pisces you are the first one that has gotten the Sun energy this is a wonderful month because what is happening is a lot of success is going to come in for you Pisces whatever is happening whatever business deal um, if you're a writer if you're an author if you have your own business whatever it is you're going to be very successful for the people who are working for other people um, what is going to come in and what is going to happen for you guys is that you're going to have there's a lot of promotion people are seeing your work for whatever you're doing and you are going to be extremely successful you Pisces okay let's look and see what is happening here you are you have the energy of the Sun the energy of this month is the energy of the chariot so that's a victory and success and this is the Sun that is bringing also victory and success you if you had um, health situation this is going to be a month where it is going to be changing for the positive let's look and see what's coming up for the first week for the Pisces you have a connection a soul connection okay um, this energy this situation whatever is happening this soul connection that is happening with you it is bringing light to a situation you're connecting with either soul family or soul mates in the second week you have a situation with an organization whatever is happening this is a karmatic situation with this organization or group of people in the third week for you Pisces there is someone that is trying to get away with something organization is trying to get away with something be careful what is happening in the fourth week you have a lot of message coming to you a lot of messages coming in to you okay I'm sorry I have to stop the reading because I need to know what is happening um, what is this organization trying to get away with because people can be very um, lie a lot of lies people you know you have to be very careful what is happening what is this organization trying and news is coming and uh, um, uh, this news is not a good news there's a lot of quarrels and situation the organization is crying or a group of people are trying to get away with something whatever they are um, trying to, to come up with you're going to see the truth of a situation that is happening I don't like the energy of the seven of swords because the energy of the seven of swords is that a group or organization because a message is going to be coming uh, um, to you and the message is not um, the message with um, um, the snake anything that a message from a woman difficult news so a message is coming from a woman and it's going to be um, a difficult um, see a message is coming I, I you know whenever I see the energy of the snake is always a woman somebody who is bitter or is jealousy lies and that sort of a thing difficult news okay um, let's see what is she up to okay um, and it's from a woman it's definitely from a woman um, what is she up to um, uh, um, illusion deception so it's it's a woman um, illusion decepcy um, popular woman okay be careful of this woman okay be very careful illusion deception she's not um, she's not very um, good it's not a nice person okay um, be careful because the, the this illusion deception touchy subject arguments related to creativity okay so um, you know you guys because this is what I'm saying and this it, it is a successful time for you guys but whoever this this woman is it's like as if you guys are working with a woman and she wants to make you you know it's, it's as if she has an ego thing that she's going through so in the third week except 
in the in, in the third week be careful of this woman because and I will know which woman it is as I go in your reading but I really really just have to see this uh, you guys are working with a woman and this a woman um, is going to be sending you as it's very deceiving so be careful of who and it's going to happen in the third week let's see what is joining the first week to the second week the energy of the tower okay so there was a situation that was going on with a group of people in an organization and that sort of a thing the energy of the tower is going to come down that means there's an ending coming to whatever this karmatic situation that you had to do with a group of people in the first and second week the second week going in the third week uh, you have a lot of burdens to carry and this has to do with the message that you're going to be receiving from this woman which is a very deceptive woman um, as we look at the third week going in the fourth week you are going to receive a message okay so it's like um, at work you have this deceptive woman on to deal with it's a woman that her ego is as big as her head and um, you have to deal because there's a lot of email and you know, news that is coming towards you it's gonna happen in the third and fourth week so be aware of this okay as we move to see what is happening with the tower and the burden it has to do with the four of Pentacles it have to do with your financial situation so maybe you have to pay extra um, uh, extra out that you weren't um, looking for maybe you have to uh, pay extra out that you weren't looking for then we have a message from the burden and the news that is coming in there is going to be an end to all the deception thank you thank you thank you an end is coming to all the deception so there was a woman that was lying cheating and everything using her ego and using her power and there is going to now come an end to the deception let's see what is happening for you Pisces for the outcomes of April you are going to be successful yay okay I'm so happy I hate when people work against each other it's just something that I just can't understand why can't we just live together in a very positive and nice way on this earth I just don't understand why would someone want to use their ego against someone you you know and this happens a lot of time that someone is doing something and you know like people scribe books or they scribe a blog or and, and there is just someone just just come because they're not feeling good about themselves because they're not having the ideas that you're not having because they have not accomplished what you have accomplished and a lot of messages and, and negative messages it's just that the person is really really having a problem with themselves so next time people that someone is going to be um, that someone is going to be like you know yeah this is not good and that is not good and I don't want this and this and that and you know sending you because obviously if you look at the message in the third week and I want you guys to remember this that in the third week you are going to be receiving a message from a woman okay and it is going is a psychic woman is a deceptive message this this message is going to cause some confusion and this is what I want you guys because you have the energy of the Sun it doesn't matter what people no weapon that fall against that form against you in the month of March can nothing okay so whoever this woman is and whoever the devil is she and the low energy is she that is coming in with her ego success is going to be yours for you Pisces so this is kind of my wonderful I love you Pisces you're just so wonderful people when you're working in a positive energy is okay because you know that sometimes you can be cheeky and you're not working in a positive energies but trust me if your heart is at the right place and doing the right thing and being honest Whoever this woman is and whatever the problems she's trying to create, it's not going to happen because you have success in this month all around. So, for some of you, maybe you have to pay a little bit out that you weren't expecting. You're trying to hold on on your financial situation. And maybe there is news and, you know, 
not to worry okay call upon the universal angel because whatever is happening there was a situation that you were dealing with is it could be people who are working in a company for a very long time or that sort of a thing that you were dealing with what you're seeing here is that it's gonna come to an end okay you have um, it's as if you're carrying a burden in the month of April it's as if you're carrying a burden in the month of April not to worry about this because I'm going to ask about the burden the burden is just um, that whoever this woman is that is out there that what is this burden I need to find out what is the burden there is going to be a solution for the burden that you're carrying don't worry about this there is going to come up for a solution for the burden that you're carrying and there is going to be a new invitation coming at you so whatever the burden that you're carrying not to worry about this okay we're going forward and um, in the middle of the week you're going to have a situation with and it's, it's, it's the people who work for people whoever you work with you're going to have to deal with this woman and she's a very deceptive woman so be careful what you said what you say to her and how you come up because it doesn't really matter this is your motto for this month of um, April no weapon that fall against you is going to survive it okay so whatever people are trying to do and whatever people are it's not gonna happen okay it's not gonna happen let's look at the love energies no the career for the ladies over 40 what is the career for the Pisces ladies over 40 you're or looking for a new job you're looking to leave your job and go in to search for a new job what is gonna happen to the Pisces man in the month of April you are going to find inner strength and this is what I saw that here in the third week you really need to find inner strength and as we look at um, as we look at the um, people 18 until 25 in work um, there's new work coming in for you there is new work new extra money is coming in as we look at love for the Pisces ladies so love for the Pisces lazy in the month of April you have listened to your intuition listen to your intuition if you want to have a new start in a relationship do it if you want to change your relationship do it listen to your intuition and love for the Pisces men in the month of April you are having your wishes and dreams coming true so your work life is that you have to find the inner strength but in love your wishes and dreams are coming true for the people 18 to 25 what is happening love for you guys you have to deal with the Knight of Wands. Okay, so some of you, and you're protecting yourself from the Knight of Wands. So some of you, um, people between you Pisces, uh, between the ages of 18 and um, 25, you're dealing with an older man, and you're trying to protect yourself from him. You're finding him to be, um, and this could be an Aries uh, or Leo or a Sagittarius, and you're trying to protect yourself from him. It's as if you don't really like this man, and um, you're trying to protect yourself. So it could be someone who is sending you text message and that sort of a thing, and you're thinking, yeah, I don't really want to deal with you. <laughs> you okay, so the Sun people. What is happening for the Sun people in the month? I think it's the Aquarius coming in. Yes. So for the people who were born in um, um, in the day, 12 a.m. till 6 p.m., you have the Aquarians coming in. Okay, and you have the Capricorn. The Aquarians and the Capricorns seems to be coming up a lot to help people in the month of April. The Aquarians and the Capricorns seems to be coming up a lot to help people in April. And then for the Moon people, this is people that is born in the night. You have to deal with the the Aries. So when you're dealing with the uh, Aries, um, that is another sign that you have to be, you know, like careful with. And then you have the Virgos. So you're dealing with the Aries and the Virgos. You're dealing with the Aries and the Virgos. So you people who were born on the night, you're dealing with the Aries. You're dealing with the Aries and the Virgos. Okay, you're really dealing with the Aries and the Virgos. So. Mm -mm -mm. let's move on and see what is um, your financial situation um, deservingness if you don't 
feel as if you deserve the financial abundance or you deserve to win the lottery it's not gonna happen you need to feel that so I deserve to have a lot of money I deserve to have a lot of financial abundancy you're a beloved child of the source creator like everyone else and you deserve to receive support that will allow you to focus upon your divine life purpose even if you can't yet recognize your lovable qualities trust that source creator and the angels can see how amazing you truly are and if you don't see and oh amazing you truly are someone else cannot see you first have to see it and know that your financial situation is going to be um, ill and the um, other uh, message from the universe it says my happiness is a direct reflection of my level of faith in the universe and this is so wonderful my happiness is a direct reflection of the level of faith in the universe okay so I want you to really remember these come back listen to it I'm gonna leave um, a picture of this and I want to say to each and every person um, have a very very wonderful wonderful exciting month of April because success is what this month is all about okay success is what this month is all about for you guys and you're going to be extremely extremely successful in this month no weapon that fall against you will prosper because success is what is going to be happening for you Okay, namaste.